there welcome over here today i am so so excited to be sharing this video with you we just moved into our house today i guess we're not even moved in yet we just have a few things that came out of our car but anyways this is a newer home that we just got in utah it's a rental home if you don't know yet we were living with my parents in new mexico for a couple of months while we were searching for homes on the internet in utah if that makes any sense but anyways i'm so excited to be sharing this house with you it's about 2100 square feet and my family's pretty excited about it I don't know all that stuff but let's get to it and I'll show you inside so right as you walk in right here you have a couple of options so there's a room right here or you could go upstairs I want to show you this main floor first just because my daughter Brinley she's napping so you walk in and there's a it's like a medium sized room, larger room, I don't know what you want to call it, but it's just kind of like an entry room. I'm thinking about putting a couch right there and then like a picture or something above it, you know, pretty simple. I'm also thinking about putting Brinley's toys in here just as kind of like a toy room and then just the window outside. So now to continue down this hall, we have our family room this is the main family room of the home it is quite large actually and then right over here we have a coat closet so this is probably where we're going to hang most of our winter jackets and probably summer stuff once summer comes we get quite a lot of snow in utah but thankfully it's not snowing today and now for the family room we're probably going to put a tv and our tv stand right there and then just our couch um right in this area as you see our clutter Brimley's toys right there those are all the toys from our car and then you know just things that came out of our car while we were moving in here and now we have made it to the dining room so this is the area we're going to put our table so we're going to put our table right here if you don't know yet my dad actually he made us a table, so I'm so excited about that. If you haven't seen it yet, I put it on my last house tour video of when we were living at in the military base, so you could go check it out there. But I'm also going to probably show you a furnished house tour of this house. But now for the kitchen, the, I don't wanna call it the grand finale, but the kitchen I'm gonna show you. Oh, but first, look at who woke up. I just woke up, yeah. Brinley just woke up from a nap, say hi. Say hi. And then this is my sister Bailey with her. Bailey's going to college in this area, so she's so kind to help us move in today. She's amazing with helping with Bryn. But this is the kitchen, woohoo! Here's the kitchen. I'm so, so excited to be cooking in this kitchen. It actually looks bigger on camera than it is in real life, I wanna say. That's just honesty right there for you. But we have an island. I have never really had an island like this to cook on. I've had a half island before, but island with granite countertops. And then this is white, so there's a white island. And then these cabinets over here are like a gray brown color they're pretty in my opinion and then more of the countertops I just think this kitchen is really pretty and I'm just really excited to get to cooking in it now for over here this is probably the first decoration we have up this came out of my car we had it in New Mexico I got all of this at Hobby Lobby and I love it this is just a window that goes over um, this sink just looks out at the neighbor's front yard and then our backyard. Nothing too crazy, right Brinley? Brinley? <laughs> now for the pantry, this pantry is huge and I've already made it messy, look at this. How embarrassing. This is just like road trip stuff and then stuff that came from my parents' house in New Mexico, you know, that type of thing, but it will be organized here shortly now after the kitchen there is a little area brinley's making noise in the background but anyways this is the garage door and then over here is just kind of it's just like storage under the stairs i'm thinking about putting brinley's toys there and making it into a toy room i just feel like that would be so darling and then so this is a kind of like a mudroom type of thing. I'm thinking about putting a bench right here. Let me know your thoughts on that. Just a bench, it'd be easier for me to put Brinley's snow stuff on or, you know, that thing. And now, right off of the garage area, 
Hi there, <laughs> this is just a half bathroom. Nothing crazy about that. And now we have closet right here, look at me. I'm already making things nice and cluttered. Hi guys. Now after the kitchen, I'm gonna show you guys, um, in that area, I'm gonna show you upstairs now. So back, um, this is the front door. We're going to go up these stairs. I love these stairs. Th these stairs are gorgeous, I think. Um, I just love the shape of them, I guess I should say. That's what I'm trying to say. But here we go, up the stairs. Now, once you get up the stairs, you have quite a few options. So we're just going to go straight. So this is just a full bathroom. This is probably going to be Brinley's bathroom. Nothing too special about it, but one thing I didn't realize um, is it has a closet back here. I did not notice that at first. It took me like an hour of looking through the house to find that closet. Now over here, two rooms. I'm sorry, I'm out of breath, but two rooms. These rooms are pretty much identical. They have the same closet. You know, they're just kind of identical rooms. We're thinking about making one a guest room and then kind of one a home office because Will's studying slash working from home right now. So it'd be a great little office for him. Out this way from those two rooms, there is another room in here. Brinley just took a nap in this room. Um, I'm not sure if she's actually going to sleep in this room. She probably won't. She might sleep in one of the other rooms. But it's another pretty basic room. Just very simple. But it is nice. Now for one of my favorite things. We have a laundry room upstairs. Woo! This laundry room is upstairs. And that is just going to be very convenient for all of the messes that we will make. And for this is, so now this is the master um, bedroom. This is a pretty big room, but it's kind of an awkward shape. I don't know if you could see how weird of a shape it is, but it's kind of weird. So we're thinking about putting the bed here. Not sure yet, stay tuned. So now for the bathroom, here is the master bathroom. It has a shower and then a large bathtub, two sinks, which is, very nice if you have to share a sink with somebody, you know, <laughs> just a bath, a toilet in there. And then this is a large closet. So this is just a really nice size because oh, obviously Will and I share a closet. I don't have a ton of clothes and Will doesn't have a ton of clothes either, but it is still nice to have a larger closet just because you could put blankets in it. You could put shoes in it you could put we don't have a ton of shoes either but you could just put a bunch of stuff in the closet and that's just always convenient because come here honey do you want to say hi you um always need more space than you realize come here did auntie give you some chocolate did aunt give you some chocolate no I didn't. Aunt, auntie bailey <laughs> i think it's from earlier you got chocolate from earlier yeah 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 <laughs> say hi say hi yeah yeah. Did you nap good? Did you take a good nap? Okay, yeah. and yeah. That is pretty much it for the upstairs. I'm gonna show you a little bit um, of the backyard right now. But here are the stairs going down. There goes Aunt Bailey. And here is our backyard. There's a little cement pad over there. And then a gardening area. I'm hoping to garden this year. I'm hoping to plant some strawberries and that type of thing to have a nice garden. I don't know if I will do that, but I'm hoping to do that. And that is a wrap of this house tour today. We really hope you enjoy it. And this is our new little home in Utah. We love it so far. I can't wait to be cooking and showing you some new videos in this home. Friday's video this week, it's going to be like $5 dinners. I filmed that back in New Mexico, so I can't wait to share that video with you, but I hope you are all doing well, and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.